Netersudol slash latanoprost, also known as rocklatin, is a combination eye drop medication that is used to reduce high pressure inside the eye caused by conditions like open angle glaucoma and ocular hypertension. By lowering the pressure inside the eye, rocklatin can help prevent vision loss and blindness. It is important to use this medication as directed by your doctor, typically one drop in the affected eyes once a day in the evening. Make sure to follow your doctor's instructions for the best results. When using rocklatin eye drops, follow your doctor's instructions and use it once a day in the evening. Do not use it more often than prescribed as it may increase the risk of side effects and not work as effectively. Before applying the eye drops, make sure to wash your hands. Avoid touching the dropper tip to prevent contamination. If you wear contact lenses, remove them before using the eye drops and wait at least 15 minutes before putting them back in. Tilt your head back, look upward, and pull down your lower eyelid to create a small pocket. Hold the dropper directly over your eye and place one drop into the pocket. Close your eyes for 1-2 to two minutes and apply gentle pressure at the corner of your eye to prevent the medication from draining out. If you need to use the medication in both eyes, repeat these steps for the other eye. Do not rinse the dropper and replace the cap after each use. If you are using other eye medications, wait at least 5 minutes before using them after using Rocklatin. It's important to use this medication regularly at the same time each day to get the most benefit from it, even if you feel well. Most people with glaucoma or high eye pressure do not have symptoms, so it's important to continue using the medication as directed. Some common side effects of Rocklatin 0.02% to 0.005% eye drops ophthalmic anti-glaucoma agents may include eye discomfort, redness, itching, increased tears, temporary blurred vision, changes in eyelash number, color, length, and thickness, as well as eyelid changes and skin darkening. These effects should be reported to your doctor or pharmacist if they persist or worsen. It's important to note that this medication may gradually cause the colored part of your eye, iris, to turn brown over months to years. If you are using this medication in only one eye, only that iris may change color. This color change may be permanent, but the long-term effects are uncertain. Be sure to inform your doctor if this occurs and schedule regular eye exams to monitor it. However, it's essential to remember that your doctor has prescribed this medication because they have determined that the benefits outweigh the potential risks of side effects. Many people using this medication do not experience serious side effects. If you experience any vision changes, eye pain, or unusual redness or swelling of the eyes or eyelids, it's crucial to inform your doctor immediately. Additionally, seek medical help right away if you notice any symptoms of a serious allergic reaction, such as rash, itching, swelling, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing. This is not an exhaustive list of possible side effects, so if you notice any other effects not mentioned, it's important to contact your doctor or pharmacist. Remember to schedule regular checkups with your doctor while using this medication. And as always, if you are in the US, you can call 1-800-FDA-1088 or visit www.fda.gov slash medwatch to report any side effects to the FDA. In Canada, you can report side effects to Health Canada at 1-866-234-2345. Before using Rocklatin eye drops, make sure to inform your doctor or pharmacist if you are allergic to netersudol or latanoprost, or if you have any other allergies. This medication may contain inactive ingredients that can cause allergic reactions or other issues, so it's important to talk to your pharmacist for more details. Also, be sure to tell your doctor or pharmacist about your medical history, especially if you have had any eye problems such as macular edema, iritis, uveitis, lens extraction slash aphakia, or herpes infection of the eye. After applying Rocklatin, your vision may become temporarily blurred. Avoid driving, using machinery, or doing any activity that requires clear vision until it is safe to do so. If you develop an eye infection or injury, or if you have eye surgery, ask your doctor if you should continue to use the current bottle of this medication. You may be advised to start using a new bottle. Before undergoing any surgery, make sure to inform your doctor or dentist about all the products you use, including prescription drugs, non-prescription drugs, and herbal products. If you are pregnant, Rocklatin should only be used when clearly needed. It is important to discuss the risks and benefits with your doctor. It is not known if this medication passes into breast milk, so consult your doctor before breastfeeding. 
It's important to be aware of potential drug interactions that could affect how your medications work or increase your risk for serious side effects. Make sure to keep a list of all the products you use, including prescription and non-prescription drugs, as well as herbal products, and share it with your doctor and pharmacist. Always consult with your doctor before starting, stopping, or changing the dosage of any medicines. One specific product that may interact with Rockladin 0.02% to 0.005% eye drops is eyelash treatments, such as topically applied by Mataprost. Be sure to discuss any concerns or questions about potential drug interactions with your healthcare provider. If this medication is swallowed, it can be harmful. If someone has taken too much and is experiencing severe symptoms like passing out or difficulty breathing, it's important to call 911 immediately. Otherwise, contact a poison control center as soon as possible. U.S. residents can reach out to their local poison control center at 1-800-222-1222, while Canadian residents can call a provincial poison control center. Always store this medication out of reach of children and pets to prevent accidental ingestion. It is important not to share Rockletin eye drops with others. Your doctor may also want to conduct regular eye exams while you are using this medication, so be sure to keep all of your medical and lab appointments. If you forget to use a dose, apply it as soon as you remember on the same day. If you don't remember until the next day, just skip the missed dose and use your next dose at the usual time. Don't take double the dose to make up for the missed one. Make sure to store Rockletin 0.02% to 0.005% eye drops in the refrigerator and protect them from light. It's important to keep all medications out of reach of children and pets. When it comes to getting rid of expired or no longer needed medication, it's best to consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company. Avoid flushing the medication down the toilet or pouring it into a drain unless specifically instructed to do so. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.